tornadoes, floods, winter storms. So how are we kept in the loop of all this diverse weather and Mother Nature has to bring Minnesota? Well, over the next few weeks, we're going to take you behind the scenes and give you an in-depth look at where this weather forecasting takes place. And in addition, give you some tips that you can use to make sure you stay safe during a hazardous weather situation. It can happen at any time. A severe weather threat can strike at any time and any place. The National Weather Service and the Storm Prediction Center is here nationwide to keep you informed minute by minute of the latest local and severe weather information and alerts as they happen. What we're here is to warn people of the different types of weather that could create problems with your lives or property. And with all the various types of weather that can strike an area unexpectedly, the National Weather Service has a different piece of technology for each specific weather event that occurs. We have a variety of technology here at the uh, National Weather Service. Uh, one is most well known is the Doppler radar and that will help us detect the amount of reflectivity in this case here the how strong the storm is with the rainfall and the hail also in addition to the Doppler radar we can detect velocity and that will help us detect rotation in the thunderstorm which will give us a longer lead time to issue tornado warnings so with over 100 weather forecast offices nationwide staffing over 4,000 employees and trained weather officials you can be assured that the National Weather Service has your safety at their first priority and will inform you of any potentially dangerous weather situation as it becomes imminent. You can get all your weather related answers and resources by checking out the official National Weather Service website where you can access live radar, view forecasts and day planners and obtain past weather archives and information all by logging on to www.weather.gov.